Hey there, this is Gerald Bass with the Rise of the One Percent, and I want to welcome you to today's video. When today's video, I actually have a special guest. I have one of our Rise of the One Percent clients, LaShawn Brooks, who's a part of our high level coaching program. And LaShawn actually was a pastor for over 20 years, and she got into coaching and developing her own course. And when she actually came to myself, she was charging hourly rates for her time. And so she got into the high level program and I was able to assist her with getting crystal clear on the client she was looking to attract, help her with getting her messaging tight, her offer tight, her pricing tight, getting a system in place to consistently generate her clients, even without running any type of advertisement. And in the first two months, she was able to do over $40,000 working with us. And over this last year, LaShawn has had a lot of adversity in her life with her family and everything, but still was able to have the right mindset and put in the work and stay consistent to be able to get these results. And now she's impacting queens all over the world and her life and business has changed for the better. And me and LaShawn is still working together at the time of this video right now to help her with scaling even to that next level. All right. And so with that said, you definitely want to grab a pen and pad and take some copious notes on this conversation that me and LaShawn have together. She's definitely a bright and intelligent woman. And let's go ahead and dive into the conversation. Hey there, this is Gerald Bass with the Rise of the 1%. And in today's video, I actually have on one of our Rise of the 1% high level coaching clients. I have Miss LaShawn Brooks on. How you doing, LaShawn? Hi, I'm doing great. Thanks. Absolutely. Glad to have you on. So I just want to start off with LaShawn with you just telling us, you know, who you are, um, what you currently do, and what were you currently doing, like, prior to working with the rise of the 1%. Okay. Well, I am a, uh, I kind of do a whole lot, really, but um I pretty much work with queens, um, ladies who are serious about their internal harmony, um, their business. We build big businesses and then also creating tribes that support their success. Um, and so before, prior to doing this, I was doing one-on-one -on -one coaching um, that was pretty much based upon hourly wages, which is way different from now. Um, so I was doing one-on-one -on -one and I wanted to scale um, to, to my one-on-ones just being valued differently and then to get into some group coaching that was also valued differently. So that, that's my, uh, that, has been, that has been my journey so far. Gotcha, gotcha. And going through high level, what would you say in terms of how we help you with getting maybe your messaging a little bit tight? I know we also work with you in terms of your offer and pricing. So what were some things that you may have discovered since you've been going through the program in regards to that? Um, I would say, first of all, like the biggest thing for me was, um, I think, confidence, you know, um, as I, I like one of the things that I love about rise of the 1% is, is we're a family, mm -hmm. you know, and coming in, in my, like my first session, it was just like, wow, you know, I got people behind me, you know, people mm -hmm. that believe in me immediately. I felt like, you know, someone believed in my product, someone believed in, you know, what I was capable of doing, you know, mm -hmm. so that was the first portion. Um, and then the skill part of it okay. as well, learning, you know, some of the sales, which I was nervous about, you know, <laughs> some of those things were, you know, um, but like literally step by step, it gave me exactly what I needed to be doing, you know, prior to being a part of the rise of the 1%, I knew where I wanted to be, but I needed steps to get there, you mm. know, and so, so going through the course, it just helped, it, it helped to give me step by step by step now do this now do this now you know and that helped majorly as well great stuff great stuff anything you would share in terms of any of our strategies that help you to land more clients because i know you landed quite a bit of clients too since you've been working with us yes 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 definitely again going back to that confidence you know the the you know learning the skill and being a part of the family 
built on my confidence. Um, but in landing clients, um, as far as the skills, just learning how to do the basics. Mm -hmm. You know, um, one of the things that goes through my mind all the time is when you talk about, you know, um, likes, it does not equal dollar signs. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> I'm like, I'm getting a lot of likes here yeah. and still like, I. okay, so wait a minute, you know, I need to have, I need to find out my target audience, mm -hmm. you know? And so singling out my target audience in the, you know, in the, within the hundreds of likes, you know, that was major for me. Finding out who my target audience is, learning mm -hmm. to speak their language, you mm -hmm. know, um, and in doing that, some of the, the assignments that you gave, like, hey, you know, what, it, what are they, what's keeping them up at night? What's giving mm -hmm. them asset reflux? You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So, um, you know, those foundational things, they have gone a long way, you know, and so it just kind of has helped me to speak people's languages. And then in some, you know, some people may be a little bit different from my target audience and not know that they're a part of it. So being able mm -hmm. to bounce, you know, and use those basics to, you know, kind of put my own frill on there and, and work with people that, you know, I just, I don't know. I, some people I didn't even expect to be able to work with, you know, and mm. it really helped me to land those clients as well. Great stuff. Yeah. Great stuff. <laughs> yeah, you hit on some key things there, being able to speak their language. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. And a lot of our exercises definitely within the high level helps with being able to do that from Pretty much when we, of course, give you all the 10 spot market diagnosis questions to the avatar and all that type of mm -hmm. stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Which is you did a great and outstanding job on. Thank you. By the way. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> so what would you say like the biggest lesson you've learned so far, you know, since working with us, LaShawn, like would you pinpoint any big lesson you've learned? I think consistency. You okay. Know? And, you know, um, just getting those basics down packed, you know what mm -hmm. I mean? It's mm -hmm. not just a, you know, we, I could get in and I could just learn exactly what you want to teach me, mm -hmm. you know, and I could put that into play, mm -hmm. but you know, you can do that in a matter of, you know, a month, you know, in a month I was, I was doing amazing with the skills, right. but I think the mindset that, that the rise of the 1% family is trying to bring across. That's, that's different that, you know, mm -hmm. it's a full package, you know, so you're going to get the skills, but there's a whole mindset behind this. You know, some of the times where, you know, you're kind of talking with us, you know, in our group session where it's like, Hey, you know, this is a good bank to go with that, you know, just, it's a whole new mindset that we're learning and you don't just get that overnight. Um, you don't get that just, just, uh, um, trying to pull, you know, information from your brain in one session. No, it, this is a whole life transformation that we're talking about, you know? So right. I would say that's my, you know, that's my major takeaway that it's a whole mindset that is being worked on here. So. Absolutely. All right. Stuff. So talk a little bit, Sean, about your results you've got in working with us life, business, mm -hmm. um, what's some of the results that you've gotten since you worked with the Rise of the 1%? Oh, we, so again, hourly, I was doing hourly and, and it, in the beginning, you know, I, especially coming from being a pastor of 20 years, I told you that in our first talk, you know, Absolutely. I was a pastor for 20 years. So in my heart, I just wanted to give a lot of things away for free or, you know, my empathy would kick in and here I am, you know, charging people a hundred dollars for years of understanding and experience in business and in, you know, emotional wellness that I had, you know, mm -hmm. um, but, but you know, coming into it, I learned how to price my offer, how to, how to value what it is that that I that I have to offer, you know, and in in valuing that, um, it helped me to recognize like, hey, people need to make an exchange, and they need they need to make a serious exchange for the time and the understanding 
that I'm putting into this thing, you know? Um, so, so, so going from hourly, I was doing like a hundred dollars per hour. Um, mm. and it would, <laughs> no, that is it. <laughs> it would have taken me like, 30 people, you know, that's one client per day, every day of the month mm -hmm. to just make my rent, mm. you know what I'm saying? But I got right. five kids, you know, right. so that ain't, you know, that's not even, that doesn't help me, you know? So yeah. I went from doing that $100 an hour to literally scaling it to $20,000 in a mm. month, you know? Mm. My first month, you know, I hit that, it took me the whole month because my mom passed away at that time. So it kind of, mm -hmm. I was kind of slow in doing it in the first month. In the second month, I did it um, in half of the time. It just, it, it just started going, you know? Um, so being able to scale from making those hourly wages to $20,000 in a month, $20,000 the next month, it was just like, whoa. You know, now we have a whole new set of problems, which are good problems. <laughs> right, right. You know what I'm saying? But okay, Absolutely. so now what bank do we do? And, oh my God, I need somebody to to figure out how do I pay taxes on this and how do right, we, right, right. you know? So it's new problems, good problems. Right. You know, um, but not sitting there trying to figure out how I'm gonna pay the next bill or feed this. You know, I have one boy. I got four girls and one boy. Like, how am I gonna feed this dude again? You know, like. Mm -hmm. So it, I, I prefer which bank am I gonna go with rather right. than trying to figure out how I'm gonna do what I need to do for my kids. So, it's it's been major a major difference for me. Awesome stuff. And what? So you were charging a hundred an hour, and what did you raise your price to? By the way, Lashawn. So what I did was instead of a hundred dollars an hour, what I did was I began selling packages. Mm -hmm. So um, my my price it went from a hundred an hour to actually if I was gonna do hourly, it looked like about two fifty per hour, but it mm -hmm. sold in a package, you know, with mm -hmm. less. You know, I was doing a hundred dollars an hour for ten you know, 10 sessions, you know, mm -hmm. so now I do a package, which is now, um, it's 2,500 and then mm -hmm. you get eight in, in that package. Um, but, but my, but my real deal, <laughs> my high ticket is mm -hmm. 4,000 mm -hmm. and that is a six week program where it, you literally go through an online, um, an online course. And at the same time, I sit and I talk with them. So it really, it really took my sales through the roof. And I realized that it is for some reason selling that hundred dollars an hour was so hard. But mm. doing the <laughs> the high ticket course mm. and the higher ticket uh, um, sessions, mm. I don't have to. I I literally sat listened to my clients tell me exactly what they like i need this i need help with this and i'm thinking okay we could do that going through my my sales script we right. could, okay that's what we offer you know um because they had already watched my video you know right. so my my video sales letter so uh by the time they got to me they were all in they were just like sharing with me their life story and how they got to this place and now where do i send the money you know, <laughs> so I was like, you send it here. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, it That's was, lovely. it was so much easier, just way less work than trying to hustle for a hundred dollars an hour. Absolutely. Yeah. And that video sales letter in terms of the pre-selling mechanism, I call it, which is a funnel mm -hmm. that's helped you a lot too. Absolutely. Getting those clients in, in terms of them watching that video before yes. having a, a real call with you, a strategy session, what have you. Yeah, For sure. Absolutely. And, you know, that video sales letter and the funnel, it literally qualifies, you know, it's like pre-qualifying someone to work with me, mm -hmm. you know? So if you don't have time to listen to the video sales letter and you don't know what I'm about, it's just kind of like, I don't know if we're going to be a right fit. Nine times out of 10, 
when someone has not really sat and listened to that video sales letter, then mm -hmm. they're not at the place where they're ready to invest. You know, if they don't fill out the form, you know, my, you know, my questions beforehand, they're, they don't have the mindset to go through the course and, mm -hmm. and you know, make waves in that course, you know, right. so it literally is, you know, it's a pre-qualifying mechanism there, you know, and it helps because I don't have to sit here and waste my breath talking, 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 presenting, 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 not knowing whether this person has, you know, the, um, the intangible solidity to do what needs to be done to go through this course, you know, but once you go through that video sales letter, you know what I'm about. It's not a game. It's a, it's, it's the real deal. So do you want to be a part of this or no, you know, and they're they're they come ready. So, yeah. Absolutely. Powerful, powerful, powerful. <laughs> Love it, Deshaun. Definitely congratulations on you and all your success and Thank you. I know you out there making a major impact on your clients. I've been seeing the success stories and testimonials yes. on your page. Yes. Keep going. Um, the last couple of questions I will ask you, Sean, is so, you know, in terms of the community field with the rise of the 1% since you've been involved thus far, well, how would you explain that? Wow. Extremely encouraging, you know. Mm -hmm. um, and of course, I'm I'm down here in South Florida, so we're in different states, but um, my heart is like, I gotta get there. <laughs> I gotta get, I gotta see my people. You know what Absolutely. I mean? I gotta, I gotta, I gotta get with my my people. One of the things that I'm really big on is tribe. You know, community. You know, mm -hmm. um, and I I believe 100 that trying to do this on your own, um, you could do it, but like it means nothing unless you really have a tribe of people that are with you, that are rooting for you. And so the feel that I have gotten is just like, it's not just, it's not just one person rooting you on. Everybody, you know, has your back. Everybody is open for a question. Everybody wants to share like how, how okay, so let's, let's make it work like this, you know? And right. so um, it's just so open and so accessible, you know, and that, that has been major for me. Absolutely. Love it. Love it. Great stuff. Well, I definitely appreciate you, LaShawn, again, for coming on here and uh, sharing a little bit about yourself, of course, what you're doing, um, your biggest takeaways and results as well that you've gotten from working well with us with the Rise of the 1%. Um, it's been a great journey thus far. You, you've been well, literally our top client for a couple of months. You high level yeah. member of the month. So uh, we're real proud of you. Thank you. Um, just keep going out there and making that major impact, you know, to the people, the way you're doing, to those queens, the way that you're doing. <laughs> and you. I look forward to definitely seeing you in the 1% of the 1% yes. in, the, in the future. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> Absolutely. <what we're> <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. So definitely appreciate you, LaShawn. And also, um, if you want to share any information where anybody can find you, um, then you can definitely share that as well. Well, I have a, a funnel that I created with the information mm -hmm. <laughs> from That's Rise good. of the 1%. It's iqueenup.com. And it's just simply there for queens who are ready to seriously work on internal harmony. Because I believe business comes from the heart. Um, mm -hmm. So, you know, people who are ready to work on their internal harmony, but at the same time, build big business and build tribes for success, iqueenup.com. And, and it'll show what we're all about. It's a great, great community. So, <laughs> absolutely, yeah, it is. I definitely appreciate you again, Lashawn, and uh, we are gonna continue working with you to help you get to those next levels of success. And uh, we look forward to bringing you back on in the near future. We help you get to those next levels. Yes, yes. <laughs> Thank you. Absolutely. So much. <laughs> All right. Thank you again, Lashawn. My pleasure. All right.